So, um, water brushing all there, or water wheeling with this drill and this uh, water wheel right here. Taking it all down to bare metal. Alright. And so far, I've found some. I don't know if that rivet's loose. I know this one is. You can hear it. That one's loose. There's a there's a puncture hole here. You can see daylight through, right? You can see that. There's a like I said. I think I think some of these rivets are loose. And then uh, I had a pinhole here that I covered up with some uh, Marine JB Weld. I'm probably gonna end up sanding all this down because it's kind of rough and then that rivet I know is loose you can see it um I've got another crack right there up here at the front and then right here so this was this was kind of dented in right here and it had a good crack it had a crack right here so what I did was I put some of that marine JB weld on it and it ended up whenever I went and started banging the dents out of it, it cracked. And so did these right here around these rivets, because I I put some of these rivets to test it out to see if it would hold. But these rivets were dented in. So when I put the big world on it was flat. So when I got put the boat over and hammered the rivets up or flattened, you know, the inside the way it should have been, it knocked these rivets loose and busted the JB world off. Busted the JB weld here, and earlier I could see daylight through it. So this is all got to come back off, 100%. 100% coming off. This is coming off 100% instead of just sanding it. Uh, and all these holes are gonna get patched. Probably I'll probably end up brazing it with some uh, map gas and aluminum rods just to make sure that the, all these are gonna get that. Uh, 3M 3200 or whatever, 5200 or whatever, before it gets painted, and then it's gonna get, I'm gonna paint it. Uh, I'm not sure what I'm gonna use yet, but that one right there is bad. Anyway, that's the progress.